When I started using ultrasound several years ago, I was immediately impressed by the level of care that I was able to provide with ultrasound, the time travel saved, the lives saved. I do full service family medicine, so I do emergency and maternity and hospital care in rural BC in a small town called Fernie, which is a ski resort known for its legendary powder. Fernie is a town of 5,000 people, and then we also serve some smaller communities around Fernie up to about an hour away, and together we're looking after about 20,000 people. We're a dedicated group of family doctors. However, we don't have CT scan, we don't have diagnostic ultrasound. Sometimes we can't even do an X-ray. Because we don't have diagnostic services, we may be considering a number of things, but we don't have a way to certify what that diagnosis is. That's why we like to use handheld ultrasound because it gives us the joy of diagnostic certainty. Handheld ultrasound, like it sounds, is a small unit that I will carry in my hand or sometimes I'll carry it with me in just a fanny pack. Traditionally, ultrasound was performed or is performed in larger diagnostic centers with quite large cart-based machines. Since the introduction of handheld ultrasounds, we can use these units that we can carry from the clinic to the emergency room to the hospital, and they can generate images that are as good as the cart-based machines, allowing us to diagnose at the bedside. Before we started using handheld ultrasound in the hospital and in our clinic, people would have to travel for diagnostic ultrasound, which is an hour away. For some people, it's two hours away. And in the winter, that was a significant risk in terms of mountain roads, snow. So having ultrasound close by and at the bedside makes a difference for patients' travel and for their safety. The Clarius handheld ultrasound can diagnose so many things. It would take me almost an hour to tell you, but anything from abdominal aortic aneurysm, any heart condition, we can look at babies in the first trimester. We can look at the kidney, the gallbladder. We use it for procedures, lumbar punctures, central lines, intravenous. It's wonderful for small children in diagnosing pneumonia as well as bladder stones. One of the advantages of using handheld ultrasound versus other methods of diagnosing people, whether it's the stethoscope or a CT scan or just your general physical exam, is one, ultrasound does not expose the patient to ionizing radiation like a CT scan does. It's more specific than using a stethoscope. So when we do studies, the ultrasound is far superior to using the stethoscope for diagnosing pneumonia and heart conditions. And the thing I love most is I can show my patient. So I can look at the heart with my ultrasound and I can show my patient at the bedside, here's your heart and here's how it's beating. And it just makes explaining conditions to patients far more satisfying. Ultrasound has also helped me save lives. One example of a time when ultrasound was very helpful was a patient who came in, for example, with back pain and slight abdominal pain. And I was entertaining a number of conditions, but I pulled out my ultrasound and right away I was able to see that this gentleman had an abdominal aortic aneurysm, which is a life-threatening condition. And I was able to convince my specialist that this patient needed to travel to a higher level of care in order to save their life. I feel so strongly that ultrasound is the wave of the future, that I've actually dedicated my life to teaching other physicians how to use ultrasound because it makes such a huge difference in patient care. I'm super excited about the future of medicine and the advances that we have made in such a short time. In a few years, we'll have handheld ultrasound all over the province, even in the far north and people will be able to diagnose conditions without their patients having to travel thousands of miles.